much riding on every NFL game. And there's no doubt the players will be ready for this early season matchup between the Minnesota Vikings and the Chicago Bears here at Soldier Field. Hello, friends. Jim Nance along with Phil Sims. We have two teams today desperately want to beat one another. It has turned into one of the great rivalry matchups around the entire National Football League. And how do you see it, Phil, before kickoff? I'll just say it this way. I don't think they like each other a whole lot. So that, that always makes for more, more exciting football, and we'll go see how it plays out. Let's check in down on the sidelines with Danielle Bellini. Thanks, Jim. I spoke with the Vikings coach this week. His offense has been great running the football all season, and today's opponent has had trouble stopping the run. He said, that's definitely something we plan on exploiting if we can, but we can't abandon the passing game. Being balanced will give us the best chance to win, and playing great defense, well, that won't hurt either. Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. Josh Scobie ready for the kickoff. That's a touchback. The ball will be spotted at the 20. Wilson's going to be the one leading this offense today. Last week, he accounted for over 200 yards passing. Late hit, it's worthy of 15 yards. Play action. Looking down the field. He's got a little bit of daylight here. Gain of seven. Maurice Jones-Drew lined up in the backfield. Third down and two. Jones-Drew's going to secure the handoff. That is enough to block to free up that running back so he has a chance to get that secondary and make a nice run out of it. Bringing the play to an end. First and goal. Maurice Jones-Drew running to the left side. Runs it in for the touchdown. That was just an awful... The Bears now will have their chance to respond with their first drive. The score's 7-0. to zero. And he'll step out of bounds. Kaepernick trotting out to the huddle. His completion percentage was well below 50. Lynch is handed the football. That picks up seven. The John. Second down, three for the first. To the ground here. Pushes aside one tackler. There's the tackle. Slot receiver. Second and six. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Will stay on the ground on first down. Breaks free. Has some space to work with. But it only gets a short game. Sliding to get away from the hit. And the kick is good. Number three. Under center. First and ten. The give. Left side. Brought down just two yards shy of the first. In the NFL wanted to be a head coach, so he goes to the CFL, the Canadian Football League. What does he do up there? He, won, he wins two great cups with the Montreal Alouettes. Now, it's a touchdown, and this game just got a whole lot more interesting. You gotta take advantage of situations like this. Not often in the NFL do you get somebody this wide open. Good job by the receiver, nice job by the quarterback Janey. And what do you get? An easy touchdown pass. the backfield here second and 11 looking to the right side and throwing that catch good for a first down touchdown Minnesota Vikings well Jim it's almost a can't be a mistake the Bears now facing third down a week ago they were up to the challenge in these spots Good job on the ground there by Lynch. When you see Law leaping out there, he was alert, read the right keys, and he was right with the receiver to knock down that deep throw. Advances it out to about the nine. This is where games are won and lost. Once an offense gets down the red zone, 
even though they're down more than seven. Start as a team. No margin for error from just outside the goal line. Touchdown and drawing close. You know, if you're a defensive player and you're covering a receiver down here on first and goal, you don't have to cover that much area. That's a terrible job by the defense giving up that touchdown pass. B, third down. And the drop back. And here he goes. They bring him to the turf. A timeout charge to the offensive. It converts on the three. That does it for the first half. Bears trailing this one. Vikings getting ready to kick it away. Fights off the hit. Breaks free. That's a touchdown. It's still one of the most exciting plays in football, isn't it? When you return a kick from your own end zone and take it all the way down the field and score a touchdown. Great moves that time by the kick return. Drews taking the handoff. They tackle him for a loss. Kaepernick under center. First down and 10. Takes it from the strong eye. Picks up the first and still has some room to run. That's what you want to do. Just get a first down, especially when you're on top. Keep the clock moving. Keep the defense guessing. Make them react instead of attack. Set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. In his hands, complete touchdown. If you go to an NFL practice, they spend about 40% of their time practicing plays going in to score. That's why they made it look so easy here. Nice throw by the quarterback on first and goal. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Has some space to work with. And he's going to be tackled right around the 31-yard line. Good job that time by the running back getting down the field and picking up big yards. He'll take the snap, the first here in the fourth quarter. Makes the grab. Now they take the football. It's a beautiful hit to knock the football loose. And he's intercepted. A satisfying defensive replay. Third and four. Launching it deep. Tough catch. Touchdown. This game is tight. What a terrible job by the defense. That time, nobody even covers the receiver. He is wide open down the field, and hey, nice job by the quarterback. Going through his progression, he finds the open guy and gets a touchdown pass. So from two yards out, they get it across and secure. First and 10. Challenging the defenders to the right side. In on the hit, Jason McCourty. Picks in some zones, some blitzes, and then occasionally go man-to-man -man coverage. Interception. They pounce on him there. Most can in five coming up. Wilson from the shotgun. And he's taken down. That's what all defensive fits. Dig in and try to stop your run. When they do that, you're going to take it the distance. The 30. 
Two minutes remaining, and you're watching. Second and two. They hand it off to the running back. As good as it gets. Touchdown. Good job that time by the offense. Scoring it after that completion. Wilson standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. And he's forced to the ground. Wilson's going to take the snap from the shotgun. The defense gets another sack. Times already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. Too much pressure, and he's brought down again. 40 yards. Some game, Phil, a big, big rivalry win and a final thought from you. Oh, man, it makes you feel good. It makes you know that you're doing the right things in the meeting room, on the practice field. You made it happen during the game, so you go away from it just feeling great about what you've just accomplished. When you have a wide receiver with this kind of talent, sooner or later he is going to make a play that can decide a football game. And the play of today's game is his ninth reception down the field by this tough wide receiver. It's been a game we'll always remember. Jim Nance, Phil Sims, so glad to bring it to you.